terms of what vlog this is. I think it's probably like number seven. I'm not sure. Just got up, I'm getting the kettle on and this has come in the post, which I'm excited about. It's um, an anti-wrinkle remover cream that I've been sent to test and see what I think, which I have agreed to, but I've said as long as I can give my honest opinion. So as I say, I've never tried this before. I've just been sent it in the post. And if it's any good, I'll let you know. Hi guys, ignore my sporadic tan at the moment and lack of makeup. I just wanted to come on and have a little chat because um, I was just thinking about how um, if you're not a parent yet, a mum or a dad or stepmom or dad or whatever, you might not know this, but everyone that is a parent does know this. It can be a really big um, stress on your relationship. It can put a lot of pressure on you both. The tiredness, the worry, the finding your feet the first year, and who does what, and just working, working it out. It's you know, it happens to everyone. Um, and obviously, if you've got a strong relationship, it doesn't rock it at all. But it can be pressure. It puts a lot of pressure on your relationship. And then there are times where it does the absolute opposite, where you appreciate your partner more than anything and that today is one of those days because it's been a hard day guys as i say it's like oh, i'm not sure what time it is let me check it's 25 past four i've got no makeup on um i've mostly been in my pjs all day because it's just been tough theo um woke up last night he went down at his normal time but he woke up and didn't go back down till about half past one and then he woke up at five o'clock this morning and would not go back down. And he has been just, bless him, just out of sorts all day. And you know where I can't find anything wrong with him. He's not got his temperature anymore. He's absolutely fine. He's eating fine, drinking fine, but just really whingy. I'm assuming he's just tired and he's just non-stop cried and whinged all day. Not even a proper cry, just like a really loud, long cry. And nothing I did would help. So Peter has managed to um, get all his work done and has then taken both kids out for a walk. And honestly, like I couldn't appreciate him anymore. He's such a good dad. It really is in these moments where you appreciate your partner. And... Um, God, it's such a relief just to have half an hour. I'm just going to put my makeup on. I'm actually out tonight, so God bless him. He's taking him now, and then he's going to have both kids on his own tonight as well because I'm meeting a friend for dinner. So I'm going to get my makeup on and start getting ready for that. Try and get rid of these grey eye bags under my eyes. And hopefully tonight I'm not back too late. I'm really looking forward to seeing this friend. I haven't seen her for ages, but I'd love to be home and in bed at a decent hour because I'm just so tired. So I've got me slap on now and I'm feeling a lot better, feeling a lot more like myself. And I'm excited for me little evening out with my friend, Steph. We've got a lot to catch up on. I haven't seen her for ages. So we're just going to go for, I actually don't know how I've angled this, but it's the England World Cup match, the first one tonight. Peter will be watching. I had no idea when I booked this meal out with my friend that it was the England match tonight. Otherwise, I might have been a little bit more considerate of Pete um, and let him go out with a friend to watch the match or something. But it's one of those things that we've been struggling to find a day for ages. And tonight was the night it fell on and it just so happens that it's the night of the match. So sorry, Pete, about that. But we'll be going to a place called Banyan on Street Lane which I've been to quite a lot, but they definitely won't be showing the match, which means it will be probably quite quiet tonight because I think everyone else will be watching England. This is the bar I went to with my friend. It's called Napa and it's in Leeds. And it actually wasn't busy at all because it didn't have many screens. I decided to try out this product for you today, guys. So here's a review. But this is what they look like. I'm not sure how many you get in a pack. And I think you could definitely just use half one of these. I think there's like 30 odd of them in the pack. Just unscrew the top. And then it's like, um, I don't know if I can 
can show you, it's like pink, but it goes on clear. So this is actually a completely different day. For some reason my camera shut off and then when I filmed this one, the audio didn't record. So I'm just going to do a voiceover. But basically you just start by dampening the area. That's just me putting a little bit of water onto my forehead. And then you pat in the product. So I'm just working on these deep lines on my forehead. I've had these since I was about 11. They have always been there. They don't bother me that much, but it would be nice to get rid of them. So I'm really working on them, trying to get a lot of product in there. The instructions say to pat it in, but I did start rubbing it in just because I saw a video where they rubbed it in and it still worked absolutely fine. And it was taking too long to pat it in. So yeah, just really concentrating on that area. And then I'm also working on my frown lines. I think that's me putting the water on. And I do have some very small wrinkles around my eyes that you probably can't see on camera, but I can definitely see them creeping in. And then um, it also works to fill in pores, which I've got quite wide pores around my nose here. So just change the camera angle so that you can see properly. This is me putting the product on to those frown lines. And I think the key is to just make sure you really don't miss any areas at all. Then I'm going to put it on my eyes and I did go underneath the eyes as well because it's supposed to help with bags. I don't really have a problem with bags, but if there's a bit of extra help, why not? So what I do like about this product is you can really feel it working. It feels like your skin is tightening up. So I'm putting it on this side and I'm going to leave the other side clear so that you can maybe see the difference on camera. I've just filled in the pores, the one side. Then, as I say, as it dries, it takes 120 seconds to dry before you see results and you can really feel it tightening on your skin, which some people may not like, but I absolutely love. And then this is me just gabbing on, explaining to you that I haven't really reviewed many products that have been gifted to me on this channel, but I wanted to say that anything I do review, I have previously agreed with the company that I will only review it if I get to give my honest opinion. I'll only ever show products on here that I think you are interested in. And if it's bad, I will tell you it's bad. If it's good, I'll tell you it's good. So now we're getting on to the before. So this is my forehead before. If you just look at those wrinkles, that's what they were like. Quite deep. And then this is the after. So I think you can clearly see the difference here. I can't believe how well it's worked, to be honest, on those deep, deep wrinkles, um, especially in the middle area where you can see I've really concentrated. But as I say, you need to make sure you get all the bits because I missed a little bit on this side of my head here. And you can see just the edge of that wrinkle. And then in the middle, you can see how well it's worked. So I have to say, guys, that I really loved this product. I also tried it on my mum and she loved it too. I didn't get to film that, um, but I would seriously recommend. I'm going to leave the link down below for you. So just click that link and that's the exact product. I've used um as I say this was actually filmed a few days ago now and I've had no adverse effects you can see here the pores have filled the side that I've put it in and the other side are visibly deeper so it's not just for wrinkles it's for pores as well I'm not sure how this would fit under makeup if you'd like me to test that out then let me know in the comments below and I'll show you how it looks underneath makeup this was just for a sunny day when I wasn't going to wear any makeup I had my night out with my friend and it was really lovely but it just wasn't really the time or place to film so I couldn't get much of that for you. So I promise to do better tomorrow. <laughs> Stop laughing at me you. So if you like this video give it a like, subscribe for more videos to come and I'll see you all soon. Bye.